Hi, I'm Megan Lewis. I'm a nurse practitioner at the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia, and I am here at the CARP Summit, and there are three takeaways that I'd like for nurse practitioners and physician's assistants to be aware of from this conference. It's a very exciting time in the field of allergy. There's lots of new therapeutics and potential treatments on the horizon. In atopic dermatitis, we haven't had new medications in many years, and we've now had this bursting explosion of new therapies that are on the market. We have um, topical medications and systemic medications and some other medications under development that are currently being researched. Um, so it'll be exciting to highlight them for primary care providers. The second takeaway is the management of food allergy. The prevalence is uh, a major burden to society and to families and the quality of life implications with food allergy are very difficult to manage. We have some new therapies in the pipeline to help treat food allergies and also the field has shifted to a focus of prevention and looking at ways that we can help to prevent food allergies. So there's a lot of exciting research going on that can help prevent the onset of food allergies in patients who are at high risk. And lastly, the third area that is an exciting thing to cover is allergic rhinitis. The burden of allergic rhinitis is huge to families and patients. There's uh, an impact on social functioning, productivity at work, and just overall symptoms. And I think it's important for clinicians to be prepared to help families manage those symptoms better through environmental controls and medications and education to help them feel better and have less of an impact on their life.